I was told that I shouldn't pursue STEM, that women shouldn't be in robotics, and I, it was really difficult to hear. Bonjour, hello, this is Danielle Boyer, and this is Post Next 50. I grew up without a lot of money or resources and not being able to afford a lot of like science and tech education. That was something that my little sister Brie was especially interested in. We wanted to be like Iron Man. We wanted to build things and create things, but we couldn't afford to. I was 10 years old. I started teaching a kindergarten class and I was like, let's bring science to kids. When I got to high school, I was the only girl and indigenous person on the robotics team. I ended up creating my organization, the STEAM Connection, to bring free and accessible technical education to indigenous girls like me so that no one would have to have the same experiences that I did. The robot sits on my shoulder because it's meant to communicate and kind of be a little pet. I can talk to the robot, it can talk to students, and it's just a fun thing that is engaging for kids. Indigenous language revitalization is important because without our language, we are not able to participate in our culture. The next thing that I am working on is fully scaling out my language revitalization robots and incorporating even more children's voices into the robots so that when you talk to them, they respond in a kid's voice and it's more relatable for kids. And I'm really excited about it. Mm -hmm.